All right, guys, Homestead Know How. Life is good. It's evening time. So we've done some things today. We welded on the tractor, got the weight system set back up on the front end, cleaned out the chicken brooders and the duck brooder, come back here and worked on the chicken tractor or duck tractor. It's mainly going to be for chickens. So we put the roof on it, did a piece of metal roofing. It's brown, and I had this from our, our house we used to live in. Went yesterday and picked up some stuff for my sister, so I end up with some soffit, which goes up underneath the eaves on a house. It's vinyl, and I had the, the J channel with it, and it just happens to be brown. So I put it on the sides, put it on the back, and then, of course, we did a sliding door. And you open this sliding door up, and you've got your two nesting boxes out of milk crates. We'll put some hay in those, and I'm going to paint this brown, and I'll put a locking system on it so nothing, nothing can get in it. And then up front, we've got our barrel lock for our door. And inside, we've got a four-foot roost bar out of a two-by-four. And we've got a two-foot roost bar out of a two-by-four, and it's connected to the nest boxes. So plenty of room for them to roost. And, of course, we'll hang a feeder and a water in here. And uh, they'll be good to go. Of course, we might end up adding some wheels. And then, of course, I've got to add... The eye screw still, or the the uh, leg screw, sorry, for our rope that we would use to pull it around with. Now, we just use one rope, and we can use it between the different chicken tractors that we're going to have. We've got two now. We'll probably have a couple more. And I just did some carabiners on that. And you can just drape it over, basically hook it over the, the uh, leg screws, and you can pull the chicken tractor forward when you need to give them new salad, as Joe uh Joe Salat Salatin, I think his name likes to say. So um so yeah, so this is it guys. Hope you all like the video. Like, share, subscribe, look at the beautiful sky, and you'll have a blessed day.